Good morning, mighty men and women of God. Today is Thursday, April 15th of 2021. How committed are we to following the Word of God? When it comes to choosing between something our flesh wants to do or doing something Father God wants us to do, how do we respond? If we are walking under the guidance of the Holy Spirit, we should be making decisions according to Father God's Word. Proverbs 3, 5 through 6 declares, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not to your own understanding, but in all your ways acknowledge Him, and He will direct your paths. How can anyone go wrong with a promise such as that? So today, this morning's prayer expresses an unfailing devotion to Father God and His Word. Father, Teach me to follow your decrees, then I will keep them to the end. Give me understanding, and I will keep your law and obey it with all my heart. O Father, direct me in the path of your commands, for there I find delight. Turn my heart toward your statutes, and not toward selfish gain. Turn my eyes away from worthless things, Father, and preserve my life according to your word. Fulfill your promise to your people, so that you may be feared. Take away the disgrace that I dread, for your laws are good. Oh, how I long for your precepts. Preserve my life in your righteousness. Father, you are my portion. I have promised to obey your words. I have sought your face with all my heart. Be gracious to me according to your promise. I have considered my ways, Father, and turned my steps to your statutes. I will hasten and not delay to obey your commands. Your hands made me and formed me. Give me understanding to learn your commands. May your unfailing love be my comfort according to your promise to your children. Father, let your compassion come to me that I may live. For your law is my delight. May those who fear you turn to me, those who understand your statutes. Father, my soul faints with longing for your salvation, but I have put my hope in your word. Preserve my life according to your love, and I will obey the statutes of your mouth. Save me, for I am yours. I have sought out your precepts. Father, your word is eternal and stands firm in the heavens. Your laws endure to this day, for all things serve you. To all perfection, Father, I see a limit, but your commands are boundless. Father, it's in the name of Jesus that I pray this morning. Amen. This is Jeff with this morning's prayer, praying that you have a great and God-filled day today. Shalom.